My friends, even though last week we celebrated the Feast of the Baptism of the Lord, I'm here with our young adults at the bank of the Jordan River, where our Lord Jesus underwent baptism at the hands of John the Baptist. And of course, the baptism that the Lord underwent is not the baptism you and I have received in the sacrament that the Lord gave us. But it was the Lord's opportunity in these very waters to purify the waters of this earth so that they can be a worthy vessel through which His grace, by His death and resurrection, can free us from sin. It's an awesome thought to consider that in these waters, John the Baptist and the Lord Himself began this great drama of our salvation. How blessed we are to be the recipients of the Lord's mercy. How fortunate we are that the waters of our baptism, prefigured in these waters, have forgiven our sins and given us life. How awesome is the love and mercy of our God. My friends, let us renew our own baptismal promises and our commitment to walk in the light of Christ and to be a beacon of forgiveness and hope to everyone we meet. For what was graciously given to us, we are asked to give to our neighbor.